Hello, everybody, and happy Easter. Hope you guys all had a great day today. I certainly did. We got the bunny ears going on today to celebrate the occasion. And we are going to jump right back into where we left off in Outlast 2 yesterday. So we just came across what our character Blake described as a heretic temple. Uh, it's pretty creepy looking. We had to crawl through some caves to get here. So uh, let's see what's going on in here. Alright, so we just picked up a new battery. Let's take a look at what we got. Bunch of skulls and looks like a sacrificial altar, possibly. All I know is that good things have not happened to this place, that is for sure. Can we make this jump? Ah! Oh, I thought we were gonna fall. Alright, but did that accomplish anything? Okay. I saw the broken ladder and I was worried that we had just jumped across that chasm for no reason. I do not like these shrieks and moans coming from deep within this cave. It's kind of creeping me out. I'm hoping we don't get scared nearly as much as we did last night because I'm still a little on edge. There's a lot of dead bodies. I'm hoping that we don't become the newest addition to the decor. Oh, no, no. Hello? Ghostly child? Is there any way I can help you? Were you... Were you one of the children that was holy crap? Oh, she's gone. Child, were you one of the children that was meant to be sacrificed but you escaped? No, oh, definitely need the night vision. At least we're back outside again. I do not like being in caves. Oops. It's not what I meant to do. Looks like a camp. Or a small village. Right. Let's not slip and fall off cliffs in the first ten minutes like last time. God loves you. Unless you're a fetus inside of a woman, then God hates you. According to these guys. I'm trying to navigate as much as possible in the dark just to conserve batteries, but I'm afraid I'm gonna slip and die if I'm not too careful. All right, is the water gonna play nicely this time? Not gonna get stuck again? I should probably be looking around just to make sure I'm not missing anything. All right. Onwards to victory. So there was four years between, what was that? Hello? Hello? There was four years between the first Outlast and this game. But I'm still just dumbfounded by how good this game looks graphically. Alright, so what is going on here? We're underneath stairs, but it's kind of a dead end. And the music's being really creepy. Can we jump up somewhere? Am I blind? We didn't pick up anything in there, so there's... It's gotta be where we're supposed to be. Did I just miss something? Oh, no, it's making that sound again. I hate it. Hello? Would you please stop doing that? I don't like that sound. And the music's not helping either. Bad combination. Alright, what do we got here? March 9th. More children dead. Great. Noth says there is no sin in such infant infanticide. As all are soldiers in God's armies, martyrs fallen on the field in defiance of the archfiend. All those babies with slit throats and charred flesh will be waiting immaculate for us in paradise. This is extremely disturbing. I thought they were just ripping children out of the wombs, but they're also burning them? 
and slitting their throats. I do not like this. Papa Noth also says that our sins find us in our dreams. Our sins find us in our dreams. What? But my dreams are nothing but the murder of my children. And I wake laughing and aroused and often wet with the involuntary lust of sleep. This person's really screwed up. I woke up this morning thinking I was wetted with the blood of a child's slit throat. But it was wetness of my own making. Holy crap. The others are having similar dreams. We have dug a tunnel so that we may meet in secret. We gather and share our visions and wonder at our meeting. I feel increasingly this is a message, but nothing holy. Boy or girl, you really need to get yourself checked out because that's not okay. At least we haven't run into anyone evil so far this stream. Unless that guy suddenly comes to life. Oh, nope. Definitely need the night vision. Nothing good ever happens in pitch black rooms. I do not trust you. I haven't forgotten about the wheelchair guy in the first game. Not taking any chances. Alright, that's boarded up. So I guess we're going upstairs. You s Holy crap. Thought that was that guy at first. We push in front of a door. We can also push it out from in front of the door, right? I am that I am Sullivan. I'm gonna let this preacher guy talk. Alright, I think he's done. Sullivan, Papa, Ezekiel, liar, Cheriton, temple to gout, an addict, coward, rapist, child killer. Oh my goodness. I am gone, and I have taken with me all with the courage to see the truth. Come after us. Hunt us down. We are waiting and eager to murder and screw everybody you set up the mountain. I don't hate you. Could Jesus hate the Baptist for being a Jew? I could not have found my true vision without years of ignorance and bullcrap. I could never have had the courage to seek the truth if not fueled by my anger at your lies. Is this like the only normal person around here? Your God is a child's superstition. Your faith is an embarrassment. The signs of the true father were before you, before us all, and you... Vainglorious, gullible, too stupid to draw breath, and you thought the visions were punishment from an angry and ominous god. Your god is afraid because your god is no god at all. Your god is your own ego, vulnerable and false, an embarrassment. My god is no god at all, but he is true, and he is here in every moment of ecstasy. And his child will screw and tear this world to everlasting glory. I do not ask you to join us. I tell you, you will join us, because our love is greater than you can ever imagine. Val. I think we read a note about Val earlier on. He doesn't seem to approve of the way Sullivan's doing his religion. Right, did we check this door? Right, not that it matters. Come on, hang in there, battery. Just until we can get somewhere with some light. Elevators are never a good thing in horror games. Power's cut off. Of course. Generator or something. Lucky the thing doesn't run on the freighters. Oh, I hear someone screaming. Crap. Gotta get low. Battery's gonna die. this door open? Alright, we might have to reload batteries because I can't see. Alright, I'm just gonna close this door behind me because I don't trust with, the, with whatever's out there. And it doesn't have a deadbolt, so that's great. Oh, sounds like that person's getting closer. Alright, so we're looking for a generator. But I should also be on the lookout for files and for batteries, too. 
All right, some light. What do we got? Barrel to hide in. Does this house have anything of use? I haven't seen anything we can pick up or look at. Alright, so I guess this basement is just for hiding if we were to get caught. Because I am not finding any other purpose for this house. Beds to hide under. Yeah, this must just be a place to hide out if you get caught. Which is good to know, I suppose. I definitely hear someone out here. I just don't see them yet. I should probably use the microphone. Nope. There's someone there. What is she saying? Rejoice. Revel in the ecstasy of the Lord. The sins of Zion are bound up and all debts to God come due. There's wailing. There's pain. There's blood, but it is joyous all, for we are in the sorrows of a travailing woman. From this arbor is a place of the breaking forth of yes, the children of hell, but also the opportunity of our salvation. For God is great, and Noth is his prophet, and Noth will reign. All right, she's talking to herself. Oh, crap. How did he not see me? His eyes are looking right at me. Alright, how are we gonna do this? Can we go in through this window? Not. What would that do? It's not like we can kill him. Hello? Are we still crouching? No, crap, someone's coming. Crap, crap, crap. Where did you come from? That was way too close. Alright, let's sneak through here. Operating in the dark. Crap, is this a dead end too? Dang it, I was hoping I could go around that house. Can we jump this? Oh, okay, good. Another dead guy. Alright, where would this generator be? Probably past where that lady is. There's gotta be a route to get around to. Oh, crap. Crap. Please. She's looking right at me. That's really creepy. I'm like freaking out. I'm surprised no one's like chasing me yet. Because I feel like they've all seen me. Her head is following me. I'm not sure if they, like, just aren't aware of my presence or if they're just not hostile, but I don't really feel like testing it. Is this where we came from? That might be where we came from. Or maybe this is where we're supposed to go. I don't think we've been here. Alright. Guessing we have to go in through the window. Oh, I don't know if you guys can tell, but my heart is racing right now. I'm gonna close this. I don't know if that does anything, but... Please don't wake up. Oh, he's gonna wake up if I grab that battery, isn't he? Please don't wake up. Please don't wake up. Please don't wake up. Oh, <gasps> <gasps> What? Oh, I thought that sound was like him waking up. I'm so paranoid. Alright, this is a different window than we came in, though. So. Oh, no, I wanted to go out. Wrong button. Alright, we gotta be going the right way, right? What, you d you're not gonna record this, Blake? Oh, crap. Oh, crap. We're screwed. We are so screwed. I knew it! Crap, where can we go? Get in. He probably watched us go in here. Oh, there's water. Oh, he did watch us go in here. Great. And I can't see a thing. Go away. Go away. Is there anywhere to hide in that building he just came from? 
crap, he's like right behind me. Close, is there a deadbolt? Deadbolt? No, we have to hide, we have to hide. Wardrobe. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't hear any footsteps, so I don't know if he followed me into the house or not. Hold to peek. Hello? Oh, I completely walked out. I meant to just peek. Oh crap, he saw me in the window. No, 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 no. Let me out the window. Let me out the window. Let me out the window. I don't know how that worked. I really need to use a bandage, but I'm going to wait till we get some. Holy crap, that lady. All right, let's hide in the weeds and heal up. Assuming he hasn't watched us go over here. Woo! <laughs> okay. I didn't think he was going to see me in the window. Okay. He's looking for us. Please don't turn this way. Please don't you dare. Don't you freaking dare. You just go ahead and turn right back around, dude. No. No. Crap. I don't know what we're gonna do. Shoot. Are we cornered? Crap. Wait, he turned around. <gasps> oh, I thought we were dead there. Well, we just used a bandage, so if I'm feeling risky, I could go back in that other house with the sleeping guy and grab that bandage that we couldn't pick up. Just so that we could be back at max again. It's not like we use them a whole lot where we really need to be at max, but who knows if they're going to continue to be as generous as they have been. It's just a quick little detour, so I guess it's not a big deal. Don't wake up! Don't wake up! Stay there! Alright. I'm not sure where Flashlight Guy went. And frankly, that worries me a little bit. Alright, we never fully explored this house, because he, he caught us. Alright, I guess we have to reload. What's upstairs? I feel like we've already used two or three batteries since we've started, and I don't like that. Alright. Alright, was there a, another room down- Oh wait, do I hear him? Or is that the sound of me? I probably shouldn't have left the door open. Was this openable? No. So is this just- This house has nothing? Oh crap, he's coming. Crap, crap. Where's the door? Shoot. Alright, out onto the deck. Nothing. All these houses are pretty sad. They don't got anything for me. I just saw his flashlight. Does that mean he's in the house? Alright, let's drop down. Can we can we drop down? Is there any way to drop down? Any possible way we can just drop down? We gotta go through the house, is that it? Was that his flashlight? No, it just... No, that is his flashlight, jeez. Alright. Please don't come this way. Did he go into the room? I just saw his flashlight. Did he close this door or did I close this door? He must have because he just went up there, right? All right. Let's head off this way. Probably shouldn't be sprinting, but I'm trying to make some distance between me and that house.
Why can't it ever just be daytime in these games? Oh, jeez! Oh, crap, S! For a second, I forgot where the S key was. Evil lady? You weren't even guarding anything important. When was the last time this game gave us a note or a battery? Oh, she really freaked me out. Oh, crap. Another flashlight. We're still looking for that dang generator, aren't we? Wait, why'd the music... It sounded like the music suddenly cut off. Alright, here's a note. Simeon, <coughs> I need to talk to you in deepest secret because of your knowing the un the unctures and such of and medicines. I hope you know I do not trade any more words than strictly needful when we make the trip in the damned world for gasoline and electricals and other such necess necessaries as we can't make. I've got something friendly with the publican boy who sells us the pills. Papa needs pa the pills. Papa needs. And when I mentioned them as study aids, the boy laughed and said a b body didn't need penicillin for studying, unless a body was studying gash. Have you heard of such things? I do not want to ask Papa for fear of I do not know what. But I do not want to accidentally poison him neither. Please come to see me, John. Penicillin. I'm not used to us not keeping the notes. Because I know he takes a picture of them, but I keep on thinking that we're forgetting to do something when I see him leave it behind. If I can find my way back to the elevator. Viva la Alan! What is up, my dude? Crap, did I just hear someone? Oh, hello. Game on, my dude. This game is terrifying. Alright, where did that person just go? Oh, is that the same woman from earlier? Oh, crap. She's, like, blocking my path. Can I... No, it's not gonna let me drop down again. I probably wouldn't survive even if I tried. Well, hello, kitty Mewbows. How are you doing tonight? Bows? Kitty Mew Bows? That's a pretty cool name. Why do you have bunny ears? Because it is Easter. Just thought I'd get in the holiday spirit. I'm doing pretty good. I'm actually pretty terrified. I'm hoping she doesn't turn around and stab me with that knife. She won't. That's good. She seems pretty passive. She hasn't really attacked us yet. And we've gotten pretty close to her. Now this woman in this house, on the other hand, she wasn't very nice to us. Alright, so we gotta make our way back to that elevator. Oh, I see you there. Yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty, um, I try to save my batteries as much as possible. So I let them run completely out and I, uh, I don't use my night vision unless I absolutely cannot see just because, I mean, I don't think I ever had any issue with running out of batteries in the first game, but I don't know how, uh, how lenient they are with giving me batteries in this game so i just don't want to take any chances like none of these houses that i went through had any batteries oh crap who saw me who no 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 stay away stay away holy crap you're fast you are really fast oh she's like right behind me can we make it to the elevator in time Oh yeah, she will kill you. Thanks! Please! Close the door! Close the door! Close the door! Ah! It's pickaxe lady! It's pickaxe lady! Woo! 
That was too close. Oh, I'm recording something. Sullivan not the modern Ezekiel. Their knives sharp for the enemy. It felt inevitable, like a dream or a memory. What does that say at the bottom? But not mine. Okay. Another surprise. Let's hope it's not as nasty as that last one. Jessica. Oh. For the father up above is looking down with love. Holy crap. Thank you for the follow, Kitty Muse Boss. I really appreciate it. How's it going, Defiance? I enjoyed watching your stream last night. Kicking butt at Black Ops 4. Alright, did we just check this door? I feel like we did. I was distracted by the follower notification that I completely forgot if we checked that door or not. How was your guys' Easter today? Do anything fun and exciting? We made burgers and brats, so I guess that's pretty fun and exciting, right? Your birthday is tomorrow. Well, happy early birthday. My birthday was just on Monday. So we, bo we both got them April birthdays. All right, what am I missing? We tried that door. I feel like we tried that other door. Is there somewhere I'm supposed to be crawling or going through the window? Thank you for the happy late birthday. We just... Yeah, that's jammed. It's got to be a window or a crawl space. I do not like that singing. It's really creeping me out. How are we going through batteries so fast? Let's check how many we have. We got three left. That doesn't feel like a whole lot. Can I just follow the singing? Is it coming from in here? No. Question. Answer. Oh! I think I found the surprise you were talking about. Um... As far as the rules go that I have listed for the stream, I just have it that you keep cussing to a minimum. Just because when I'm when I'm playing the game, I try not to cuss just to keep the stream, you know, friendly for all ages. And it's kind of funny that I say that while I'm playing a horror game, but just keep it to a minimum. Just because I have a lot of younger viewers and um Viewers that are sensitive to that kind of stuff that watch my stream. Oh, we're back in the school. Wait, I should probably have my camera out. Jessica, is that you? I completely forgot about our old friend Jessica. Oh. That's not Jessica. Whoever that was, that's not Jessica. All right, what was the point of moving this cart? Do we put it in front of the door? Is something evil gonna try to come out of this door? Just leave that there, just, just in case. Jesus loves me, this I know. I am like freaking out. No, no, we're not doing the staticky camera again. Last time that happened, we got sprinted at by the administrator. You have to watch a vid. What? I didn't see no video in here. Maybe we have to come back, I'm assuming? Because I did not see nothing in here to watch. Probably have to face it at the screen. Can we rotate it at all? We're, we seem pretty much stuck in this little, this little area. Unless we can find a way to rotate this. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Wait, we're stuck on something. Can we move this out of the way? It's on wheels. You would think we can move this bookshelf out of the way, right? 
Nope, nothing's ever that easy. Mm -hmm. Maybe we have to come back? Unless, can I just turn on the projector and project it on any wall? Oh, no wait, that's, that's not what that does. Mm -hmm. Well, with that, we're already at the half hour mark. So for the people watching on YouTube, I'm going to end the recording here. And uh, when we come back, we're going to explore more of this school and possibly figure out how to turn this stupid projector on. See you then.